अभी क्या नहीं था ना एक हमें रीलोड देगा अब तो हम हाथ से हाथ लेते हैं हमें रीलोड कराना मैं बोरोतल वाले बैरल है बैरल लेगा The premium for a barrel of crude oil is approximately 35 US dollars. I will elaborate on how the payment is made. The company called Coral Oil placed their bid stating that they would import only Brent. However, they imported what is called Siberian Augustus. At the time of imports, the world market price was between 74 and 76 US dollars. However, since they bid for Brent, the price was 103 US dollars with a premium of 8.25 USD. The loss alone in importing 80,000 metric tons of crude is between 25 to 30 million US dollars. Who looted this money? Here is the tender bid document. On the 25th of July, Ceylon Petroleum Corporation awarded the tender to Coral Oil for the Brent price with a premium of 4.98 USD. However, 4 days later, on the 29th of July, the minister puts forward a cabinet paper increasing the premium to 8.25 US dollars. That is an increase of 3.35 US dollars, thereby awarding a direct and indirect advantage of 35 million US dollars to this company. But Sri Lanka does not have money to even make an advance payment. Therefore those who offer credit are forwarding unsolicited proposals. The people need to know the gravity of the situation and how deep these unsolicited proposals are. If a low bidder comes forward, they must be awarded 10% of the sum. Then the central bank says, "We do not have the money and we are in default." Thereafter the main dealer says no to the advance and requires payment via the NRA system. That means a non-resident account. The Coral Oil also requested payment in that system. So the central bank which does not have money to pay the 10% advance promises to make the payment in US dollars within 30 days. Then the CPC deposits 115% of the petroleum value in rupees. The central bank converts the money to USD after shipment is received. Thereafter a premium is also paid. The governor of the central bank must respond to this. How is it that the central bank that could not source dollars on day 1 make payments in US dollars within 30 days with the premium? Approximately 1.2 million US dollars is obtained as a bribe from every single shipment of refined fuel. If four vessels reach Sri Lanka, that's approximately 8.3 million US dollars. Who are these people? Is the central bank governor unaware of this? Who is money? The local agent of Coral Oil. This person has sent an email to the CPC. Attai jaise matuna. Me reer yaku kaud. Maha bank ko adipati variya meka dhan ned. Kaud me mani kine kina. Men me ayana CPC ekad email leka. Ar the Honorable Minister and the CPC team agree to award the next six months on the same basis. Please confirm the lay cans for the rest of the period September to January 31st. Warm regards. Money. Kaud me money. Who is this person? How can the minister and the CPC agree to such things without calling for tenders? How is the central bank governor preparing the payment plan for US dollars? They are looting 8.4 million US dollars per month from refined fuel. At a time when the children are malnourished, three-wheeler drivers are finding it difficult and mothers are unable to feed their children. This type of looting should be considered a national crime. The premium for a liter of diesel is 32 US dollars. The premium for a liter of petrol is around 25 US dollars. Where is this money going? There's no point in tweeting every day because you're losing followers. We must take this matter to the courts. The ideals of the Aragalea have not faded away. The next Aragalea will come from the people who are in hunger and not the middle class. The police and the military will not be able to stop it. The MPs on that side said ranil vikramasinghe is the man in the bond scam and it is he who brought arjuna mahendran when visiting japan the president had a transit of 6 hours in singapore the newspaper said he met with the singapore ministers however we are told that he had lunch in singapore with arjuna mahendran i would like to state that i had breakfast with the minister i had lunch on the singapore airlines flight i had lunch after i boarded the flight i can show you the menu as well i am disappointed that mp marika is making a false statement marika also said that the middle class will bring an argale this was previously mentioned by hiranika premachandra i am happy that both of them are thinking alike i do not agree it is clear that mp marika is following the footsteps of hiranika premachandra mathiniya ge adipare marika 
I spoke of something in the media. When you were my leader, you were aware that I would never follow the footsteps of Hirunika.